Hey everyone, um, so I have a haul today and I know that we like to do hauls, or at least I do, and I pretty much only make haul videos, um, but I think they're the funnest for some reason. I really like watching them and I really like making them, so sorry if it's getting boring, I don't know, um, but I do have quite a few things um, that I just got recently the way. Um, so yeah, I'll just get into it, and the lighting is very bright, and I'm sorry. Um, anyway, so I guess I'll start off with, uh, J.C. Penny. I feel like I got more stuff, but I don't really see anything that I would have, actually. Anyways, um, so I got this purse, and it looks, I know it looks like old lady-ish, because of the floral print or whatever, but I don't know, I really like it for some reason. Um, I think it is the floralness that I like about it, and it just, like, I don't, it looks kind of modern because of the, like, the buckle thing and the leather. Anyways, it has a zipper in the back. I already put all my stuff into this purse, so that's why it looks all bumpy. Um, but yeah, it's kind of... It's more long than my usual purses. Not long, wide. So it's kind of, it, it looks kind of weird because it's shorter and wider. But yeah, and it has a long strap on it so I can wear it. I only like long strap purses so I could just wear it like that or because like when I'm at Disneyland it's easier to have a long strap so you know your purse will stay with you. I haven't worn one of those short ones, like short strap purses, in a long time. So, oh, it's got this, and this was on clearance, probably because it's just so ugly. Um, and it was originally $34.99. Wow, I didn't even know that. And it went down to $17.49. So, yeah, that was quite a bit of a drop in the price. But yeah, I really like it, and. Um, yeah, it's like my new purse that I wear all the time now. Um, anyway, so, also from JCPenney's, I got a coat finally, because I have a coat, but it's white, and I'm not really a big white fan. As you know, I love black. The stuff in the coat is flying everywhere. I love black. I only wear, I try to wear as much black as I can for some reason. I feel more comfortable with black on. I don't know why. Um, but anyways, I got a black coat, and it's so cute. It's what I wanted. Like, when I picture a coat, this is kind of what I picture of how I want it. But anyways, this is what it looks like. And it's kind of hard to show it because coats are long, and this is not long. There are hairs on it. But anyways, it has, like, um, a weird collar. I don't really like the collar, but when my hair is down, it's not really noticeable. But it, like, has these weird, I don't know, it's weird. Um, but then the buttons are really big, and there's four. I don't know where this one went. I guess I have to buckle that up. And they're really big, which I kind of like. I don't know why. I don't know why I like anything. I just do. But there's only four, and I think that's really cute. And then the bottom is my favorite because it, it like, it's like a dress. I don't know if you can see how, like, fluffy, loose it is. It's so cute. And then the back has that little thing, and it's, like, big. I'll probably do, like, an outfit of the day, maybe, with this, because I'll probably be wearing it a lot now um, when I go out, because it's been really cold lately. But, uh, yeah, I really like it. Also, the cuffs of the sleeves, or the cuff, the sleeve, I don't know. Um, it's also like the collar, so it's kind of weird. And this is in a small. I like this small because it's more fitted. And this this brand is called Chime, I guess. It was originally a hundred dollars, but we got it for thirty nine ninety nine, I think. So that was pretty sweet. It's cheaper than even like Forever Twenty One coats, at least some of them. Anyways, and then also this is kind of weird, but I know a lot of people like show this stuff kind of, it is kind of weird, but I got this really cute bra, and Irma, you know I love this bra. I got this really cute bra, okay, and this is kind of weird that I'm showing it on YouTube. I don't 
really know why, but it's just so freaking cute. I know that velvet is like a trend thing now. Um, everything is velvet dresses, velvet skirts, which I actually hated a while ago, but I found that I really like velvet. I don't know why. I just want to buy velvet stuff now. Like, this is velvet dress. Oh my gosh, that I really want. It's really popular on Topshop. I don't even know if Topshop is for the U.S. I have no idea. But anyways, it's really cute. But I got this bra. Okay, and it's velvet. Look at that. And it's like, it has these, which I think are okay. These little jewels. But it's just so cute. It's, and it's like, oh my gosh, it's so cute. I just had to, I had to show you that. It's just adorable. I have no idea how much this was. I think it was like $12 or something like that. Maybe more. I don't know, but it's really cute. And then I got underwear too, but I don't, I'm kind of hesitant to show it because they're, they're kind of underwear. I cannot say the word panties. I don't know about you, but I hate that word, and I know a lot of people do because I found it on Victorious that uh, Jade also hates it, so I'm not the only one. I cannot stand that word. I don't want to say it. It's just weird. Um, but I got underwear. I'm just going to show you this. Show you this just like a little glimpse of it. They're like boxers. Yeah, I know. And they have like the cool boxer thing, and I have no idea what this brand is. Flirtitude? Kind of weird. Um, but I got three different ones of these. And I got one in, see how cool the detail is? I got one in black and white, and then white and black. And yeah, I really like them. They're so cute. Um, yeah, so that's all for Disney Pennies, I think. And then, um, the other day I went to, um, Planet, not Planet, wait, Planet Beauty. And it is in a mall in Riverside, I think. I think they have a bunch of Planet Beauties, though. But, um, yeah, I got this nail polish, and it is from the Muppets collection. And we've been wanting Muppet nail polish for, like, so long. Like, before it came out, I knew about it, and we started like dying because we knew that it was just going to be amazing and it really is amazing all the colors are awesome but we only got one because they're so expensive OPI it's like nine dollars for one freaking nail polish so we just get like one at a time but um, the one that we got was um, Gone Gonzo and it is beautiful I don't even know look at it I mean the camera does not do it justice this is like it looks like I just put metallic all over my nails, and it's just, it has little sparkles in it. It's just so pretty. I wish you could see how pretty it is. Like, I can't stop staring at it. Um, yeah, this I'm so glad we picked this one, because this one's beautiful. Um, and it's just Gone Gonzo. If you don't know who Gonzo is, he's the blue character, and this color it looks exactly like his fur. Like, he's what I think of when I look at my nails. So they did a really good job with this. But pretty much it's just a glitter nail polish, and it has the silver speckles in it or whatever. And I put on, I don't know if it's the nail polish I put on underneath it. I put one coat of a blue nail polish because I wanted it to be all blue. Because if I didn't, the glitter would probably, like, show through my actual nail, and it would be kind of weird looking. So I have no idea if the reason why I love it so much has to do with the color underneath. Like, it made it look better. I have no idea. I have not put it on just by itself. But, I don't know. The color I put underneath it was from the Texas collection called I Want to Be a Lone Star. Which, it says I want to be a Lone Star. There's no W in there, but I just say I want anyways, because I think that they might have messed that up. But anyways, I put one coat of that, which is very sheer, so I don't think that has anything to do with why it looks so amazing. But, it's beautiful. Anyways, so, also, I got, um some more Disney sweaters. I know, um, I'm sure everyone knows that I'm obsessed with Disney sweaters. I have three now. Um, the only thing about these are that they aren't as, um, amazing as the old batch, which was, like, all of those, that picture that everyone saw, the one with, like, the Little Mermaid, Aladdin, Beauty and the Beast, all of those, like, Lion King, those six ones. Those were, um, terry cloth, I guess, so those were really soft on the inside. But now their new ones aren't as soft. I don't know why they're not Terry. Okay, this is going crazy. But, um, yeah, they're still 1980, which I think they should have been lowered down a little bit, the price, because the uh, fabric isn't as nice as the old 
batch of Disney sweaters. But anyways, I still love them. So I got this one, and this is the um, 101 Dalmatians one. And as you can see, it just has all of the... I'm trying to fit it all into this. Yeah, you can see that. It has all the animations and Cruella de Vil is on there too. And I really, really, really like this sweater. I, I don't know why. It just, my attention was drawn to it. It's so cute. And yeah, this isn't a large. So that's all they had. They only had two of these left. So I just got a large, which I kind of like the fitting of it. It's just kind of like baggy. Um, and then I got another one, which I'm wearing. And this is probably my favorite one by far. That was a weird shot of my neck. Um, and this one's also not the cherry cloth, this one's kind of the plain one, but this one is the Toy Story one. Look at how cute it is. Oh my gosh, I love it. And it just has all of your favorite characters. Um, Jesse, Woody, Rex, Buzz, the alien dude, and Porkchop, right? Porkchop. Yeah, I love Toy Story. I am obsessed with Toy Story. So when I found out that they had these and I found it at um, a promotion one, I just automatically got it. I didn't even care that I was spending another $20. I have spent $60 on just these sweaters. I don't know what's wrong with me, but I'm obsessed and my sister got one too. So she's probably going to do a haul later. I don't know if she really wants to, but she got a bunch of stuff too. Sort of a bunch. Uh, a couple things. But um, yeah, she got one too and I think I got her obsessed with the Disney sweaters. But, um, yeah, I love these. This one was 1982. 1982. No, it was 1980 also. Um, yeah, that's, I think that's it. I think that's all in my haul. It was very long for not very much things, but, um, I just wanted to do it anyway. So, yeah, um, I don't know what to say. Uh, subscribe if you want. If you don't want to, don't do it, but I think that you should just because. Um, and I guess check out the links in the description box. And yeah, hope you have a great day, a wonderful day, and I'm kind of getting really hyper. I don't know why, but okay, I'll talk to you later. Bye.